Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're doing an Accepting All Trades with the Toronto Maple Laughs here. And yeah, we're probably gonna get some big trades, I would imagine anyway. But we shall find out, so I'm going to just continue. I'm doing the expansion draft again, simply for the fact that you get a lot more trades that way. So yeah, there we go, 89 overall, continue. And I will turn owner mode off, add a contract year. I don't want you editing my lines because you're a jabroni. I'll turn morale off and nope, no exemptions from the draft. Too bad, so sad. I don't want to hear about it. I think that's pretty much it. Add contract year, salary cap. Yeah, okay, neat. Continue. Here we go. Rules and settings. Obviously, I got to turn injuries off. And I also want to turn auto save off because it just floods the save slots. And then I get this pop-up every time, you know, I have to go through and delete them. And there's no easy way to delete them all. Uh, yeah, just trade off notifications, obviously, on. Waiver notifications. You know, actually, we'll just leave that on, too. Won't even put it for star. And head coach firing, sure. Let me know who cans their coach first. If anyone does. I'm assuming someone probably will. Okay. Let's start it up here with the Toronto Maple Leafs. And let's see how things go. How many trades... Will we get probably a lot? It just typically works out that way. I'm going to hop in the draft just to see the first few picks. So Sim pick, we get medium elite England. Wow, what a player. Sim pick, 79 overall. Sim pick, all right, there we go. Let's see what player the Rabbits get, and then we'll, we'll call it after that. Sim pick, there you go. They get a medium top six. So how many X-Factors abilities does this guy have? Oh my word, he's already a second line forward. That is an elite pickup for the Detroit Red Wings. A third line checking forward here for Arizona as well. X-Factor and a few abilities to boot. There you go again. And yep. Does this medium top six have any? No. They got finessed. Now I did do add contract year. So we shouldn't have to do any contracts. Yeah, it looks fine. We're okay there. Let's sim to free agency. And then I believe we can modify our trading block. And start getting spammed with trades. Alright, here we go. Trading block. Boom. I want to see if we can get any, like, big players. You know what, actually? Once, I'm going to keep draft picks, like, first off. Yeah, let's try that. I'm going to keep first picks off. We'll leave thirds on. But, yeah, I'm pretty much accepting any player here. And I want to try and get rid of some of our... Our big guys, like Matthews, Marner, Tavares, I want to see if any of them will be taken. So, we will leave some of the... Yeah. Okay, there we go. And then I'll add Matthews, of course. Let's see if he ends up going. I will add Marner, whose trade value is actually kind of low, surprisingly. And you know what? Let's put Morgan Riley there. Alright, there we go. Our surplus will be anything. And our current picks. Yep, sure. You can take our first pick if you ever so desire. Let's get rid of that and make it generic again. So forwards, any forward pretty much. Defensemen, any defensemen. And goaltenders, any... You know what? Should I do pending UFA? Nah, let's do goalie. Yeah, why not? Okay, yeah, because this is surplus as well, not once anyway. Yep. Looks good to me. Let's try it out. See how many trades we end up getting. The calm before the storm. Sim to next season. Here we go. Tyler Ennis for Abramov. And then two-thirds being exchanged as well. There you go. Except Dmitriev for... No, not the Wayne train. That's just plain rude. All right, except... And we get Scott and Labushkin for a fourth and a seventh. Sure, I guess. Why not? Noel for Bunting and Kampf. How is that a fair trade? We're getting fleeced right now. Oh my word. We're actually getting robbed. Like, this is outrageous. How are these trade values? Anyway, I don't have a choice, so accept. Evander Kane. Okay, accept. Sure. That's an interesting one. We are getting rid of Giordano and Kerfoot for... Like, why? <laughs> what is this? Holy crap. Larson. Okay, now we're talking. Nice. We got Kane and Larson on the team. Saad for Abruzizi. We take that. Some picks for Lilligren and Joseph Wall. Except. 
Getting a ton of trades here. Kasha in exchange for a fifth and Weston. I feel like our depth is pretty much gone. Engvall for Primo and Patera. Okay, except, yeah, our team's getting rinsed here, essentially. Jason Spezza, no! Why? Knock it off. Take some of the other players. Blackwell, okay, and Anderson. For <laughs> These trades are just outrageous. Absolutely outrageous. All right, we finally made it to the season. I'm just going to sim up to the regular season, see if we get any trades during the, the preseason. Maybe we will, maybe we won't, by the looks of it. I think not. I guess everyone's too scared to trade for Matthews or Marner or Riley or anyone that actually has some decent trade value. So don't you dare. Yeah, our, <laughs> our depth is just not there. It's not present. But we do have a Vander Kane and Saad to play with Tavares. So that's nice. Okay, Ennis Robertson and Steves. Interesting. What about defense? Oh, don't like that. Do not like that. They both shoot left. I could do... Mm. Well, I'll take 0-0 over a dash 2 on the first pair. So, yeah, that's okay. Sandine. Does he shoot? No, he shoots left as well. Lundqvist. Ooh, I could move Larson down, but no, I don't want to do that either. All right, we'll just run with that for now. And that's our offense. And net, we've got Campbell and Mrazic. Very nice. Because, of course, they updated our trading block. So I'm going to get rid of... You know what? I'll get rid of you too. I'm just going to put Matthews there. And I'm going to put Marner. And I'm going to put Ry or Tavares, apparently. And Riley. Yeah, there we go. Or should I maybe put Sandine? No, we'll leave all these guys here. Okay, wants. At least that wasn't really updated. Never mind, it was. Let's get rid of all of that nonsense. And replace it with... Even more nonsense. Any forward. Any defenseman. And you guessed it. Any goaltender. Come on down. All right. The trade block is once again open. And we are going to start simulating the season here. And we are off to a very hot start. Nice. Okay. Are we ever going to lose? Honestly. And we lose to Detroit. They did get that very good draft pick though. So understandable. Have a nice day. Zach Parise. Sure. All right, except best roster. I don't even think I made, well, they're probably going to put that dash to defensive pair again. But anyway, okay, this trade's kind of a wash. Nothing really super interesting going on there. Except that best roster. Apparently, it's not a wash because we were using one of those players. Uh, Talbot, okay. Oh, no, we're losing Larson. But I think he was on the first pair causing that dash too. So we're okay with this. We got a goalie. Sure, except... And you already know my answer. Magnuson for Brody. <laughs> oh, we're getting robbed again. Best roster once more. But apparently it doesn't matter because no one wants our first line. And I think that's all that we really need. And now we're losing two more players here who aren't even on deals for a fifth and a sixth pick. So that is another interesting trade. Brassard. Okay. Okay. Yep. Give me roster players. Give me roster players best roster you already know it and now we're getting fleeced for muzzin except our defensive core is gone we have is morgan riley the only player left i guess we still have rasmus sandine but i think did he go i can't even remember there's been too many trades already well i spoke too soon there goes sod and sandine in exchange for two players who are probably you know like <laughs> Sub, definitely sub 80 overall, but would they be, let's find out. I'm going to accept it, but I just want to edit real quick. What overall are these guys? We get a 77. Okay, that's not bad. And 62. Well, there you go. Somehow we're still floating on here and managing to keep a pretty respectable record. Okay. There's another trade for us. Best roster yet again. No! You absolute snakes. All right. Well, there we go. Our second line has been diminished. Doesn't exist anymore. Okay. I'm not even reading them anymore. We just sent two players down, though. So maybe we just got two more players that are making the team. That's a trade I'm here for. I have follow and Edler. For a fourth or fifth. Yeah. 100%. Except that. Okay. 
Okie dokie. The Nashville Predators fired their head coach as we play them. And their new coach, or I guess interim maybe, ends up taking a dub against the Toronto Maple Leafs. Okay, let's... Marcus is a buyer. Enter the deadline. Do you think I could find trades for... Matthews? Like, okay, you just got him off of us, and now you suck. Hold on, can I find a trade? I can. Yeah, I'll do that. Sure, accept trade. I mean, I don't really have a choice anyway. Philip Forsberg. Oh my goodness, we can make a trade. <laughs> for Nylander and two-thirds. Oh, there's another one. For John Tavares. Ooh. <laughs> let's get rid of John Tavares. Yeah, let's accept that. All right. I love this new fine trade feature. Varlamov. For... <laughs> oh, no! Why did I do it for a goalie? I can't say no now. There was actually another trade there I could have looked at as well. Klingberg, Carlson. What about Ryan Ellis? We can find a trade there. Okay. That's the only one, except just a whole bunch of moves going on here. I think we're going to make it out okay, though. Should we bring back Phil the Thrill? What can we do? Oh, yeah. Five trades. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Let's just... I guess... Sure. There we go. Fill the thrill. Boom. Our team's going to be sick. We're actually going to be sick. Can I bring back Connor Brown as well? I sure can. Magnuson in a third. All right. Accept. Nice. I am very interested to look at our roster. Can I bring on John Klingberg? No, I cannot. Eric Carlson? No trades found. Brent Burns? Nothing. All right. We might have... We might have uh, got rid of all of our options here, basically. But, wow. That was a lot of trading going on. I think that will pretty much wrap it up. What about Yandel? No, okay, yeah, we're done here. We've made a lot of moves. Let's go put our team together and see what we look like now. It's going to be pretty different, radically different, I would think. Other than the first line, of course. Matthews with 76 in 62. Pretty good stuff going on there. So we got Philip Forsberg now on the first line to play with Matthews and Nylander. Or, sorry, Marner. And then we got Nylander, Broussard, and Kane. Brought him back. Parise, Sevier, and Brown. Kachuk, Robertson, Beckman. We're winning the Stanley Cup. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Spoke too soon. It's not awful. You know, we literally only have left-handed defensemen, apparently, other than Ryan Ellis, but it's okay. And in net, we got Varlamov and Campbell. Two good goalies. Nice. Let's do this thing. Watch us actually suck now somehow. Add Varlamov, like a better goalie, by two overall. And add some other good players to fill out the, the bottom of our team. So we're not just a first-line squad and just end up doing horrible. I mean, it's kind of actually happening. We are losing a lot of games here. Luckily, we already had 42 wins. But I don't even know. We might not qualify here. Okay, that win might have just set us over the edge. We are still in. We still made it. Got the Tampa Bay Lightning here in round number one. So let's have a look at some of the season stats, shall we? 99 points for Matthews, one shy of breaking Hundo. We finished third in the Atlantic, 97 points. Pretty good. Entire league. Where did we finish? Somewhere down here. We finished 11th. The 12th placed and 13th placed Sabres and Panthers, respectively, did not make it in. And then... Yeah, 18 and 17 did make it in. Okay, let's have a look at some individual player stats, shall we? Matthews, as I mentioned, got 99. Marner with 97. Forsberg only put up 62, but he could have been struggling before he got here. Let's see. Uh, yeah, he was 17 and 20 with us, so that's pretty good. But a dash one. I guess we did struggle for some reason after the deadline, but... Anyway, Nylander with 86, so we had three point-a-game players. Riley, 56. Kane, 54. Scroll to the bottom here. And if we go to our goaltenders, Campbell with a 9-10. Varlamov with a 9-18. So both goalies did pretty good. Even Mrazek did all right. And six shutouts for Campbell. Attaboy. Let's check out the entire league, shall we? Vasilevsky, no shocker there. Allmark, boy. And a 9-20 for both of them. 244 for Allmark, 231 for Vazzy, and a 914 for Hellebuck, 917 for Igor. Defenseman, we've got Victor Hedman with 90 points. Wow. Kale McCarr with 80. Letang, 72. Same with Hughes, Carlson, a nice amount. 
That is quite the run for you, Victor. Forwards, we have 101 from Nicholas Backstrom. I love that for him. I actually love that for him. Matthews put up 99, puts him in second. Seb tied him with 99. 52 goals for Matthews. Will that be enough for the Rocket Richard? I think it will based on this. And Crosby, 93. Okay, let's do this. Playoff time. Will we get rinsed in the first round? Yeah, it looks like we probably will. We sure will. We got one game out of them, though. Oh, they went on to win the Stanley Cup. Okay, Tampa, not messing around. They beat us in the first round and then went on to become the champions. We only got three points from Matthews in five games. Don't like to see that. But anyway, let's have a look at the awards here. Stanley Cup goes to Tampa Bay. Carolina with the Presidents. And Minnesota ended up facing Tampa in the finals. Individual trophies, the Art Ross with Nick Backstrom. Great stuff. Kucherov with the heart. Hedman gets the Norris. It's actually like one of the first times I've seen these be different players. And uh, yeah, Backstrom with the Lady Bing. Trevor with the Calder. I feel like he's been winning it in a lot of my simulations recently. Stamkos with the Con Smythe. Vazzy with the Vesna and the Jennings. Klingberg gets the Masterton. Patterson with the Jack Adams. Crosby gets the Selkie. Cooch with the Ted Lindsay. And at least we get one. Matthews with the Rocket Richard. Nice. Playoff tree. Here you go, ladies and gentlemen, a sweep in the finals. You don't like to see that, but it was the only sweep in the entire playoffs. Wow. But on top of that, not a lot of seven-game series either. Huh. Well, hope you guys enjoyed that one. Let me know what team you want to see next, and I'll see you soon.